Come on, the sun's about to set. This is one of the things I love about you. Yeah, what's that? For all your mansions and luxury cars and $3,000 suits, you still enjoy something as simple as a sunset. Oh, no, it all depends on who I'm sharing it with. Mm. Freezing. I'm gonna go get my sweater. Stay here. I'll keep you warm, hon. No, I'll be right back. I'm so sorry. How did you do that? What were you thinking? Someone was gonna steal it? It was force of habit. Here, my hand's smaller. Let me Excuse try. me. I know what I'm doing, okay? Oh, great, you're stuck. Here, pull. Uh, will you stop? You're just making it worse. Oh. There, better? No. How could it be better? We're still here, aren't we? Stuart, I'm sorry. It was an accident. Oh, man. Stuart, why don't I get a rock and we can go smash in the window? Well, you'd like that, my brand new Range Rover. No, Stuart, if we had to be stuck somewhere, it could be a lot worse. Look at the stars. It is pretty incredible. Maybe we should just camp out here. Yeah, I don't think so, OK? Why not? <laughs> because the camping equipment is locked inside. Oh, right. Yeah, right. I'm sitting here freezing. At least you have a sweater. Here, take my sweater. I don't want it. Look, a car. Oh, yeah, like he's really gonna stop. Why wouldn't he? I mean, even if he does, do we really want him to? Well, Stuart has some faith. Hi, Hi. thanks for stopping. Um, look, something happened to our car. Could you give us a ride? We need to use a phone. Uh, Adam May's uh, Cozy Courts is down the road about 30 miles. That sounds great. Stuart, come on, we got a ride. No, go ahead. I'm not leaving my car. Stuart, I'm not going by myself. Thanks a lot. Really appreciate it. <laughs> you guys better ride in the back. Well, it is just for one night. Remind me not to take a shower, please. Well, I admit, Ida Mae was a little eccentric. Eccentric? The woman was talking to herself. Probably just lonely. How could she be lonely? With all those cats. You do know I'm allergic to cats, don't you? Sir, I'm sure if you call your father at the resort, he would send a car for us right now. I am not calling my father for help, OK? Well, then relax, all right? I'm sure there are no cats in here. <sighs> you know, in a couple of years, I'm sure we'll be able to look back at all this and just laugh our heads off. I doubt it. Stuart, where is your sense of humor? It's out in the desert, Brenda. I said I was sorry. Oh, that makes two of us. We should have just gone back and got in the car. What was your idea to stay here? Only because you were whining about being so tired. You know, it's really not that bad. How are we supposed to fit on that thing? Well, if we snuggle real close, I'm sure it'll be fine. No, I'm just going to crash on the chair. Stuart. I just want to get some sleep, OK, Brenda? Fine. Look at this thing. My dad is going to kill me. I knew I shouldn't have listened to you. Great. Beautiful. I knew I should have stayed with this car, but hey, what do I know, right? Stuart. Oh, right. Ha ha. I can't wait to laugh about this someday. <laughs> <laughs> 